hello everyone welcome back on my channel so today we'll see how to create relationships in power bi within the tables so this is so much important for creating the reports because if we have a multiple tables and we can't set the relationships then we are not able to create the reports by using the multiple tables data okay so for that we need to create the relationship among the tables then only we can add the columns from different tables in the same report okay so this is the requirement sheet we have so we have the data for this event category and the country table we have to create the relationship among that tables by using the manage relationship option on the home tab in the power bi desktop will explain you in in detail in the power bi desktop so i'm sharing this document in the description so you can download it from here and you can go through by your own so on that manage relationship option here we have this new option and after clicking over on this new option we can have this list of the tables then we have to select the tables on which we have to join these uh, tables on which IDs. So we have to select that table from this drop down and then we have to select that column names and then we have to create the relationship or else we have this uh, second method by dragging and dropping that field over here. So here we want to create this relationship among category ID and the event category ID. So we have to only uh, drag this field and drop it here. So it will create the relationship uh, like this. Okay. So we'll see it in the Power BI desktop. Okay. So let's see. So now here we don't have any relationship in these tables and uh, we have to do that okay so here we have this manage relationship option on this home tab so here we can go and we have to click over here on the new so here we have this drop down as per that sheet and from here we have to select any table so we have to create this relationship among event and the category table so we have the category id here and in this event table we have this event category id okay so we have to join it on this table this column after clicking over this column we have to select this column and from here we have to select this column so that it will join on this column category id and the event category id so here we have the many to one relationship within these two and uh, from here we can set it what we want if we want the board direction we can set it from here and this is for the single direction okay so we have to make it as active then we have to click over here if not then we don't have to select this okay so after that click ok and close it so it will create the relationship among these two tables and when we move the cursor over this or on this line so it will shows us in what on which columns we have created the relationship so here we have this event category id and the category id is connected so that we, our two tables are connected now okay so now we'll create the relationship between continent and country so here we have the continent id and here also we have the continent id so the another way of connecting these two tables is just drag this field here from here and drop it on this so like this so it will create relationship among these two okay and for creating the relationship among these two we have the country id here and also we have the event country id here so we also have to drag this field over here so it will create the relationship so it's that simple to create the relationship in power bi but by analyzing the data okay so this is what i need to show you and uh, yes that's it so thank you for watching this video do like share and subscribe my channel for upcoming videos 
press the bell icon so that you can receive the notification thank you for watching this video